So for my guilty pleasure, I'm gonna make like a, a, a scallop and pancetta roll. I need a few things. Scallops, amazing scallops, local, South Australian, ideally. I need some pancetta, I need some deep, rich flavor. I need some HP sauce and some mayonnaise that's been cut with a bit of, a bit of creme fraiche and a nice, flat, not too bready bread roll with a little bit of chew in the dough. All right, we're here at San Jose Small Goods. I'm here to meet the man Jose himself because he makes the best flat pancetta and I need that for my roll. Oi, how are you going? How are you, man? Good, how are you? Long time I see you, bugger. Jose is like a Portuguese legend here in South Australia. He creates jamons, prosciuttos, flat pancetas, round pancetas. He's always got amazing stuff kicking around his fridge. Some salumis that, you know, he keeps tucked away just for himself. He's probably got more guilty pleasures than I do, actually, thinking about it. Show me, show me. Oh, look at that. You've got those ones there, we've got this one's here, but I think those are the best ones. They're nice and mature. Give me one with a bit of age on it, man. I want age. Nice and, and firm, I guess. Firm and thick. Yep. Look at these. Wow. As Jose is, is slicing this pancetta, I can see a deep, rich color from the pork, which immediately I'm drawn to it, right? I start eating it and it's like creamy and it's rich and it's got a deep fermented flavor in it. These are kind of probably six months old and that's when you start getting that amazing texture. It's, it, it's, it's hard to describe it, Some, that pork could actually be that creamy. So I've made the journey over, it's dawn, it's freezing cold in here. I know the water is kind of about eight degrees right now, which is gonna be super cold. There's great white sharks kicking around where we're going today, but I'm dead excited to get in, get down there, have a look at the ocean bed, and start picking up scallops. So down here at 15 meters, this is where the scallops live and you can see them as the shells are, are open. As I approach them, the shells, the shells start to, to close. We're after the big ones, so we're deliberately picking ones that are tucked under this beautiful colored coral. We're just picking them up one by one, get them in the net, get them to the surface. There's so much pleasure with this role because I get to go out and I get to scuba dive with my mates or get to go down and pick these scallops myself. So there's a certain pleasure in that, being able to, to, to put this role together and look at it and go, my mate Jose's cured the flat pancetta. I've been diving with my mates for the scallops, crack on some mayonnaise and some HP sauce on there and bingo, I've got an absolutely amazing, guilty, but pleasurable snack. <laughs> 